right now is some people who um, took Red Hook News' music and made their made like their own versions of it with like lyrics and stuff are trying to claim my videos. There's two instances, my Ari video and my Trimmer video, because I used quote unquote their music, which actually belongs to Red Hook Noodles. So I have rights to use Mega Mo Red Hook Noodles' music, so it's not an issue with that. It's just these people need to stop trying to claim his music on my videos. So um, that's what's affecting my channel right now, but it's very small. You guys won't notice a single difference. Um, the only difference you may notice is different ads than you're used to seeing on my um, those two videos, the Ari video and the Trimmer video, just because um, it's not me supplying the ads anymore. It's um, these other companies who are trying to claim the video, so that should be sorted out pretty soon. It's not a big issue whatsoever. Um, the other thing I want to talk about while we have a bit of town time here, guys, is um, ever since I started my channel, you guys have already, all my really big fans have known that I love Wukong. He's my favorite champion by a long shot. I think he's awesome. I think he's really fun, and he's just my favorite champion. And what goes along with this is, actually, I'm going to come over here and help out, is um, a lot of you guys want to know how I play her and want to see guides and stuff, and the problem with that is is if I do a guide, and hello, if I do a guide, um, my footage, like or like, I guess the guide, it's not really updated. Like when I upload a YouTube video, I'm not gonna take it down when the, when the um, info I put in it. For example, like if I say, use these ruins, and that change my mind, I'm not gonna take down the video to ch change that, right? I'm gonna leave the video up. So I have to overlap it with new videos all the time. And that just becomes a giant hassle. So what I thought, what I did, what I did recently was I decided to make a guide with my Wukong setup in a walking guide. So if you guys want to check out how I play Wukong and my guide and everything I, I, I can tell you, teach you guys about Wukong, um, that is the place to find it, is in that walking guide. The link to that will be in the description below. And um, one last thing I want to discuss before I get back to talk about the gameplay is um, in the outros of my videos from now on until this issue with the music is sorted out, um, my outros will not have music anymore by Rag Noodles. They will just have a commentary by me explaining the outro. And if you guys like this, go ahead and let me know that you like it. And if you don't like it, go ahead and tell me, tell me you don't like it. Go ahead and let me know. I know a lot of my um, usual viewers don't even look at the outros because they already know everything about my channel. But anyone who's new to my channel, the outros really help keep the viewers around because it gets them know about my new video, my old videos and it helps them subscribe and blah, 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 blah. So I like having an outro, but I want to know what you guys think would be best for my channel. So I'm going to come over here and try and... Oh, it looks like our support in Italy is actually picking up that kill. So good job to her. I'm gonna look towards. Actually, we should do dragon. Do drag. Oh, it looks like they're all here, actually. I could fight these guys, no problem. I'm gonna block up whatever she's trying to do. Alright, there we go. Come here. See ya. Alright, I got a double kill. Let's see. Where's. Where's number. Th here we go. I'm going to dash the minions. Come on. Please. Man, she hurts. There we go. Good job. Good job, Evelyn, picking up that kill. It looks like Jax is actually here, which is pretty scary. I'm just going to toss this out to try and help. I'm actually going to go in all in on this ribbon. I'm gonna try and get out of here. All right. Oh man. Yes, yeah, save me, save me, Lucian. Good stuff. Alrighty, awesome. So as you guys can see, my ult does a ton of damage, but the problem with it is, I think it's kind of overpowered and underpowered at the same time. I can only use it when someone's knocked up, but its cooldown and damage is so good. Like its damage is so high and its cooldown is so low, like 80 seconds. That's ridiculous. And when you max it out, it's like a 30 second cooldown, so it's really strong. So. I think Yasuo is strong right now, but he needs to be, he's only strong under certain circumstances, if that makes sense. Like his W is a perfect example. It's good, but if you don't use it correctly, it's worthless. So That's just the issue I've been finding with him. I'm going to get a longsword here and work towards getting some lifesteal, because I think that would be really beneficial for my kit. And it looks like we're sitting at 8 no here, so we're doing really well this game, which is really good. So hope you guys are enjoying this, because I know I sure as hell am. Looks like Malphite's trying to do better top lane, which is good to see, considering he got killed by Riven for first blood earlier on. But he's picking up again, so that's good. It's good to see. It looks like Jax is heading past the blue buff, so we could actually catch him out here pretty easily if we want to. And it looks like Evelyn's caught him out. Let's get this guy. And there he goes. Easy peasy. Alrighty. <laughs> Bye. Malphite. Alright, so I'm going to push mid here a little bit here and just get some farm. As you guys can see, we're sitting at 107 farm in, let's see here. Um, oh, hi. 
Not really sure why you're trying to fight me, but you are. See ya. <laughs> Riven's really not that strong right now, so I can just, just completely outtrade her. There's not a whole lot she can really do. But I'm gonna sit here and try and push this tower, actually, in an attempt to make things happen. And I'm gonna take a tower hit here, but that shouldn't be of issue. Alrighty, so let's see. It looks like Akamorph, our Nidalee, is actually getting caught here a little bit, so I'm gonna try and help out. Looks like this Jax is getting nice and low. Nidalee's gonna pick up that kill, no problem. But Karma's going ham, but it's not doesn't look like it's gonna work because we got Evelyn here. And here comes Lucian. There we go. I don't get an assist for that. No, I feel like I helped, but regardless, it's still good. I'm gonna dash this minion here and then dash to Urgot. Come on. Nope. I changed my mind. I changed my mind. I hate this idea. I, I couldn't dash to him for whatever reason so well. I'll just pick up that minion. Or actually, I won't. I'm weaker than I thought. I'm actually just gonna farm the Wraith camp because I can get some health back because I do have Lifesteal Quince. And I do have this shield that will keep me from taking too much damage, which will help. And I took a bit, I got some health back, which is good to see. And it looks like our Evelyn's going a little ham there and dying, but that's not a big deal. I should be able to farm those. Alright. And I'm going to try and use my Q on the jacks here, just to proc my passive. Damn. I got way too CC to do anything. What I was trying to do there was knock him up and then ult him, but <laughs> Riven came in there and stunned me and ruined everything, unfortunately. So I go down, but it's not the end of the world. I'm going to get some lifesteal here because that will help me out a ton. And I'm also looking towards, towards getting my static shiv because that's actually a really good item on Yasuo because it gives him a lot of mobility and attack speed and crit. And as you can see, my crit chance is at 90% already just from two, like what? One, two, three crit items. It's ridiculous. So his passive is really strong for that reason. And I think it's honestly kind of overpowered. But to balance it out, what they've done, actually I'm clicking on the wrong thing here, is if we read this, Yasuo's critical strike chance is doubled, but his critical strikes deal 10% reduced damage. So it's kind of cool. So if I were to do, um, let's say 100 damage, you know, or to crit with it with my Infinity Edge, it would do 250% damage, right? But it would do 10% than that because of my passive. So it would do 240% instead of 250. That's the way of balancing out. I think it's still a little bit overpowered the way it is, but... It is what it is for right now. Um, Yasuo is pretty fun. He's just kind of strange. But I'm going to look and try and help out these guys. I'm going to see if I can avenge myself because this Riven, <laughs> Riven killed me earlier. So I'm going to see if I can pick her up. And it looks like Jax wants to fight. Can I catch up to Riven? I'm going to flash and dash here just so I can get her. Gotcha. Now I got the red buff, which is going to help me out a lot. I'm going to clip these minions, pick this one up. Alrighty, and it looks like I'm coming behind this guy. He'd probably get some of these guys. Oh, there's three of them. Holy crap. Let's get in here on the Zed. Alright, all in this Urgot, and bye bye See ya. There's a double kill for me. <laughs> Beautiful. Yeah, this game's going very well for our team. Alrighty, so let's push this tower. And see if we can get the inhibitor, because we should be able to. Actually, no, Jax is here. I don't want to fight him on an under tower. That's a bit dangerous. I'm going to head mid, actually, and just get some farm. Yeah, this game's going very well. You know what's kind of funny, though, I found with Yasuo? Is his quotes and stuff? Like, he sounds pretty normal. Excuse me, pretty normal. I don't know why I burped there. That was odd. <laughs> but, um, yeah, he sounds pretty normal. But when he's using his abilities and stuff in-game, he sounds like some, like, like, you know those stereotypical, like, like Asian guys who are really, really freaking good at combat and are making all these sound effects when they're fighting, like things like that. I, I'm not trying to be racist. That's just what what it sounds like to me. I have no idea what they're saying, but I think it's really cool that they can make, they make these funny sounds. Like I think it's I think it's great. But Yasuo, he's not like one of those guys who is speaking in a foreign language. He just does that when he's fighting. Like listen to him. He's like or something like that. I have no idea what he's saying, but it's just it's kind of funny. And this why, why did I stop moving? No. I'm just going to auto the hell out of this guy. And pick him up. Easy peasy. Yeah, so we're sitting at 14-1. This game's going pretty well in our favor. So let's actually try and get this tower. So they do have two down. Alrighty. So let's go ahead and look towards hitting this tower up. If we get this tower, we can get a free in here, basically. It looks like one of us is going to have to tank it for now, but that's okay. We can do this. 
Boom. Easy tower. Let's get this inhibitor. Yeah, we should be able to disinhibit inhibitor, no problem. Alrighty, and there's the inhibitor. Alright, there goes Karma. She's out of there. Oh, I gotta kill my dash. I didn't know you could do that. Crazy. <laughs> I mean, I know you could because it does damage, but it does so little that I didn't think I'd actually kill him with it. But hey, I ain't complaining. And that is a dead Malphite. <laughs> Good all by Ergot. <laughs> That's hilarious. But like when he throws out his ta his uh, tornado, he's like, or something like that. I have no idea what he's saying, but it, it's it's weird because he doesn't talk like that normally. But when he's doing his abilities, he does. It's, I don't I don't get it. Oh well. And he's down. All right, cool. Picking up another kill for me. And that alt, the best. Oh god, I'm taking a lot of damage here. All right, looks like we picked her up though, which is good to see. I'm gonna head back to base here and pick up some items. I'm pretty low on health, and I've got a lot of gold to spend, which is gonna be really good for us. And man, this game is such a blow up. 41 to 8. That is crazy. I didn't expect the game to be like this, but hey. Um, hopefully you guys are enjoying it, because if you are, that's perfect, that's what I'm aiming to do. I'm going to pick up my static shiv here, and then grab, um, look, I think a hydra should be really good on Yasuo. I think that'd be good. Blade of the Room King is also pretty good, but I like hydra, that seems like fun. I'm going to sell this Dorn Blade and pick up a dagger, uh, not a dagger, a pickaxe, because that would give me a bit more damage than the Dorn Blade would. And I'm going to head top and just farm this up, because there's a lot of minions up there. But right now we're sitting at 163 farm at 21, almost 22 minutes, which is not great, it's not bad. Uh, we could be doing a whole lot better, but to make up for that, we have 16 kills, so we're definitely not behind in gold, which is good. That's the main thing we're aiming to do, is not fall behind in gold. But yeah, for right now, it looks like my team's just chilling in their base, not doing a whole lot. <laughs> but hey, we're just going to push this up and have some fun with this. And clean up all these minions, and yeah, you can see, he's pretty strong. As far as defensive items go, I've seen some Yasuos I've played against run Frozen Mallet. I don't know if that item's any good on him. I've seen it. I see how it could work, but I prefer to just go Glass Cannon with him and maybe pick up a GA. But that's just what I've done so far. I don't really know what I like best yet, honestly. Alright, so I'm going to clean those up. And I'm actually going to clean up their red buff, because I think that would really help out my damage output and my ability to stick to opponents. And I'm going to try to get a top tower as well while I'm up here. Alrighty. It looks like we got another turret, damn. Yeah, my team is just going ham on them, it seems. Alright, so I'm going to upgrade my W again. The W is very weird, because it works in some scenarios, but in other scenarios, it's completely useless. So I don't really know what to tell you guys, um, whether it's good or not. I mean, when it's in the right scenario, when you can block like an auto, like an AD carries auto attacks, it's very strong. But in some situations, it's just terrible. But it looks like they're actually grouping up over here, so... Oh, Jax is... I'm gonna die of the minions. That's no good. Let's see if I can pick up Urgot. Oh, it looks like the game's actually pretty much over. Alright, guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video here today. If you did, you know what to do. Make sure to leave it a like rating, guys, because that really helps out my channel. And if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to my channel to stay up to date with everything coming up in the future. And if you guys want to check out other things like my streams and uh, other events that I might be holding or doing or interacting with you guys follow my facebook and my twitter pages those are where i post things like that and my live streams on my twitch page obviously and those things are all in the description below and last but not least guys if you're new to league of legends or want to make a smurf account if you use my referral link in the description of my videos it actually helps me out a lot if enough of you guys make or make a new accounts off of my referral link and get to level 10 i may actually be able to get medieval twitch which would be really cool so if you guys could do that that would help me out a ton and i appreciate all you guys' support and i'll see you guys later peace out if you enjoyed the video here today, please consider dropping a like rating. It really helps on my channel a ton. If you want to see more videos similar to this one, make sure to check out my last video. The link to that is on screen. If you want to subscribe to my channel and be more up to date with my upcoming videos, just click the subscribe link in the top right. If you want to be more than just subscribed and want to know about my streams and my upcoming events, check out my fan pages. The link to those are all in the description below. Hope you guys have a nice day, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out.